Eleven twenty six twenty one. Happy Thanksgiving weekend holiday to you. Nasdaq one hundred. Boy, that one down three hundred and forty points. Had a three hundred and seventy eight point interday range. High was sixteen three oh two. Low was fifteen nine eighty nine. And we closed down hard. We closed and we're headed toward that fifty day moving average. Once again, the chart has daily sales signal. There's a lot of other indicators that are not on this chart that we look at. With our pre-built systems that we train people with, is we're here to offer that training directly to you so that you will be able to monitor these markets the right way and the only way. And so the selling has started today. Continued selling will create more volatility ahead. So if you don't know how to handle volatility, well, you better put a seat belt on because you're going to need it. Look, we called the correction up here when we got overbought, and it's only normal to come down in bull rallies to test moving averages and whatnot and pick off the good ones. But remember, we're long overdue for a pullback and this pullback is quite big. And Monday, there could be continued selling and continued volatility. Volatility works two ways. It works when the stocks go up, upside volatility and downside volatility. Let us teach you about volatility so that you can make money with the kind of volatility that happened today, and there will be more volatility next week, bigger volatility.